Last week, we talked about switching sounds to make new words. So we're gonna review that real fast before we move on to today's lesson. So let's think about the word belly. Can we switch the b sound to a j sound? Jelly. Great job. So today we're gonna to talk about prefixes. Now prefixes are portions of a word that alter the meaning of like a base or a root word. Um, you add it to the front of the word and it gives you a whole new meaning. So we're gonna read a book today that's gonna to teach us a little bit about it and then we're gonna do some practice. So now that we've read the book, we are going to start working on some anchor charts for the prefixes that we learned today. We're gonna to start off with the word or the prefix re. And if we look back and think back to the book we just read, we can remember that re means to again. So we'll write that. And then we gotta think about some of the examples that we heard in the book. Um, my personal favorite in the book was to restart. So we'll, we'll go with that. And then we gotta think, now let's, let's piece this together. Re means again, and start means to begin something. So put it together, restart means to start something again. a sentence. Um, let's think. We can go with, after I messed up, I had to restart my test. We see how the anchor charts work. Do we have any questions? Awesome. We'll move on to the next word. All right, now we're going to do our last one. This prefix is the prefix dis. Does anyone remember the meaning of dis for the book? The opposite of. Good job. Anyone have an example? Distant. Ooh, nice try. But let's think about that. Does the word distant have a root or a base word? No. No, so would that still be an example of a prefix? No. No. Does anybody else have a, a different word? Dislike. Dislike. That one works. And what does dislike mean? Do not like. And who's got a good sentence for this one? I dislike tomatoes. Yeah. All right, now we're going to work on a little activity where I'm going to read off some words to y'all and y'all are going to tell me, I'm going to read off some root words for y'all and you're going to tell me which prefix it matches, all right? First up is happy. Unhappy. Unhappy. Awesome. Next up is obey. Disobey. Disobey. Okay, job. What about turn? You turn, you turn. Turn, nice. Wow. <laughs> All right. What about connect? Disconnect. Disconnect. Could that go somewhere else too? Uh, Reconnect. 
unconnect. Ooh, good job. Wait, what'd you say? Unconnect. And unconnect. Does this go in all three categories, you think? Yeah. yeah. are really, really similar to prefixes, except they go at the end of the word. Things like ink or er, but we'll work on those next week. 